it was today o'clock that I realized that the Ringo Starr concert's tomorrow, not today. I thought it would be a Saturday concert with a Sunday off day. Apparently, I got that switched up. I think I was fixating too much on it being 8 as an o'clock instead of June 8th. It's June 9th. Did they switch the days? I've been like conned or some shit? Or has it always been on the 9th? In my head, I just, I think it always was the 9th, but in my head, it was like, it's on a Saturday because I'm leaving on a Friday. I'm gonna just explore Austin today. I could just switch and ruin it. We'll be fine. I'm wearing my Coachella shirt as pyjamas. Pyjamas. I'm gonna go eat food before I fully get ready to rip the day. Okay, cool. Let's go eat. This is why I should have brought my house slippers. the neighborhood. Put my glasses on. I can't get over how great this place looks. I'm especially loving this. Is he gonna be outside again? <laughs> My stuff is designated over here. I ordered this last night. <laughs> Had a little bit. But now I'm gonna eat for breakfast. I made sure to put five stars in there if you whenever they have stuff like this, I'm like, yeah, I'll give them five stars. This is the egg puff. Chicken puff. This. Um, I tried some last night, clearly, but I thought I got this, and instead I got this. So, I did write that on the app. Got a $1.68 credit. Originally it's $2.99. I'll take it, whatever. You say, I don't know. Not a sweet. Definitely would need to soak this in. I will for a different tea, not this tea, okay, good. Because home skillet said I could use this tea and look at this tea stash. <laughs> oh yeah, look at this tea stash. Hells yeah. Wait a minute, what is this? Oh, okay, cool. Doesn't this remind you of the wave? <laughs> for a second I was like, hmm. <laughs> Very cool, nice. Does anyone else do this? If it is possible to fit in the toaster, you just toast it instead. It takes a while to preheat a freaking oven. So I'm like, might as well. Is it working? Yeah, it's working. Nice. I will say, it's better to put this in like a little pot and steam it on here, but whatever, man. This is the go to for like practically everyone. Yeah. Also, without feel, they come in like the short size everywhere I go. But usually, it's like a dollar or two bucks, so you don't really mind it. But I went mad. I went mad. This is the chaos that has ensued, which I will clean up. But this is the water that was complimentary. And this Airbnb, it has electrolytes. That's crazy. I think the Coachella water also had 
electrolytes, the water bottle. It's funny because it says music water. So I guess they put electrolytes in all the music festivals. This is Austin, so ACL makes sense, but huh, interesting. Any Burning Man people out there? Do they do that for y'all too? Other music festivals? Woodstock, I'm kidding. <laughs> I really don't know any other ones. Not on the top of my head anyways, but anyways. If they do do that, sound off in the comments below. I've never said that. Ugh. So, YouTube cheese. Check out. Well, I finally cleaned whatever those specks were on my glasses. Can't believe I just now realized that. Another news. Random musings number one. I think James Dean would have been a great YouTuber. He looked like a hipster. He had these glasses, therefore I believe he was a hipster. He did photography in New York for the love of God. Or at least he did like a photo shoot. And he hung out at this like coffee shop called Goobies. I looked it up in LA, it's no longer there. It's now a shopping district. But Goobies seemed like a pretty chill place. Also, did Google get their name off of them? Dun, dun, dun. All right. Time to go wash my hands for the first time in this bathroom. Me you. Oh yeah. like this that I realize wow people really do be living the good life someday someday I shall too I promise you Whew, and it's with that heat wave I'm realizing I'm going to be wearing shorts and thank god I wore sunscreen and I'm not gonna be walking outside a lot today it'll be a lot of exploring with going in shops or coffee shops in between too hot. Throwback to when I said lavender rose anything. Proof. I got this. You may have seen this in like my other videos, for example. I got this in Salem last year when I went there for Halloween. I did vlog there. I just never posted it. Who knows if I ever will, but yeah. Cute. Okay, I'm gonna go get lunch. So I was looking up KBBQ places. There is a place that straight up on Google Maps says it's BTS's favorite. Kind of skeptical, but I'm sure a basic Google search to see if they've ever been there would be like debunking that or not. But I called them and the prices were a bit... Mm. So I um, did more research and decided to go to this one because you can take home the food. So usually they don't let you do that. So. so that's literally the first place that's ever done that. So I'm excited about that. And um, yeah, let's keep going. I'm so like drained because of the heat. <laughs> I haven't even gone outside. The sky, the 
doesn't turn on the air conditioner. He just did now, but he was gone and it wasn't on, but now it's back on, so cheers. Let's go get some KBB gear. Put my hair in a high ponytail, which made me forget how much I love ponytails. Yeah, yeah. Let's go. I had to switch shirts since the uh, the orange shirt had a stain, so I had to switch to the boring one. I should have brought in more tops, but there we go. Okay, I'm ready to go. My love is air dry when we wear it, but I think I'm pretty good for now. So. Okay, weather status. It feels all right, feels all right. It's a cute little doggy. So pretty. It might be a serious black Harry Potter or anyone. Serious, um, Harry needs you. <laughs> so this is where Sirius has been hiding, eh? Uh, just kidding. You're in the afterlife. Holy shit, I'm a dog whisperer. That dog was barking at that lady who's just delivering packages. I give her a sympathetic nod like, gotta do what you gotta do. You should be good. But that dog didn't bark for me. <laughs> I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing because you're doing your job, dog. But I didn't go that near the fence, so. Eh. Either way, let's just say I'm a dog whisperer. <laughs> All right, that name is hysterical. Time to go to give Kay Baby Care. Decided to wear it, <laughs> but it needs to dry. But I figured it's gonna dry faster from wearing it. I'm not sure if that logic is sound, but I'm cranking the AC up. Hoping the 25 minutes of driving will have had it significantly better. Eh, the shirt's passable. But anyways, here we are. Honey bee. My beloved box. <laughs> it's a hodgepodge. Woohoo! All in all, the sauces are mixed. All right, I'm happy that I ate because I felt fatigued because the weather will do that to you. And I think now is a good time to go check out some Austin places that I remember. Let's go. Okay, this is a cute little Target. Oh, cute little Target. Got some things for the Target haul. I got Dr. Teal's bath bomb. Just finished the bubble bath at home, the Epsom salt one. So I wanted to try the bath bomb version. Orange juice with pulp, because I like pulp. Delicious strawberries, oh my goodness. The fruit of summer. Last but not least, hummus and pretzels. These are a staple. 50 years? Is this one of the OG Alamo Drafts house? Look how small that is, it must be. Finally, I also got the rose bubble bath. Target didn't have it, so I went to Walmart. I haven't tried the rose one. I've always in the lavender or eucalyptus, so excited to try this out. Putting the groceries away, but I do want some orange juice, please. <laughs> wow, the pulp is stuck on the top, that's crazy. So I'm going to shake this. I thought I got the some pulp version. Seems like I got the high pulp version. Gotta get that vitamin C. Can't tell you how much. 
how much that hits the spot. That is a good measure. Yes. Mm, this one's Suda. Mm. 